Yes. Okay, good. Well, it's two now. Uh, the number matters for what the boss does because if it gets to, uh, the boss has, does special things this is to incentivize you. Um, okay. Uh, the number one, it rises to two. Uh, that um, the boss cackles like mad. Um, all right. And that ha and dots happen at the end of your turns. So now we flip to the bad guys. Okay. Uh, Susano, you are hit by three vulnerabilities. So you are at vulnerability three because there are three guys here and you're the only one on the play field. Yep. Okay. These three, this ninja here is going to go ahead and throw a shuriken at your face. Shield. Wait, okay. which one? Okay. Yeah, he's at seven range. All right. Shield. Yep. All right. So first one. It's a good uh, game, guys. Are, it's a good game. You were hit for three plus three, six points of damage. Uh, three. Uh, I soak five and I move three. All right, you're gonna move closer to the second guy because he's gonna throw a shuriken at you. Uh, hold on a second, I just need a quick measure. It doesn't matter. I can't get. I was just wondering if I crowd control that guy if he moves away from me. But yeah, no, I'll move. Because uh, this guy's gonna attack you next. You want to move into counterattacking range? Uh, yeah, but first I'm gonna have to uh, tap a hit point. Okay. Uh, this second guy throws a shuriken at you. Sword. You want to... Sword. All right. I've got six. I've got three fives. He hits you for three plus three, six points of damage. Uh, two. Shit. Uh, three, and then I'll tap frenzy. Okay. Ah, I'm so angry. The last guy who's out of counterattacking range throws a shuriken at you. He rolls a five. Not great. Wow, you're just taking everything in the face today. Uh, three plus three is six. All right, let's see. I'm down. No, wait, hold on. I've got some things. Yeah. Uh, minus six, you said, right? Yeah, yeah no, I'm down. You... Even if I tap automatic arms, uh, it's still just going to take me to uh, five. So you, you, you can choose not to tap it because uh, you'll go down. Uh, I thought we had right. this conversation before where you have to tap everything on the way. No, I, w we had the conversation, and I thought you were right. So we wrote it in the rules. You don't have to tap it if you don't want to. That's the good news. The bad news is if you go down, your hit points are automatically set to zero. So if you, they weren't already zero, they become zero. Uh, that, maybe that's we, what we talked about before. Yeah, that was the compromise. You don't have to tap soaks if you don't want to. You can just go down whenever you want. But if you do go down your hit points drop to zero no matter what. This is also for the anime thing if you want to fake it. You can just walk up to someone and say, oh, I'm actually dead! Ugh, and then tap it in zero. Aha! I was just fooling! This is a very bad round for me. All right, so you go down. Um, okay, uh, well, that's bad guys. Um, All my debuffs go away, though, right? Nope. Ooh. Oh, oh, hey, sorry. that guy's moving closer to us. I like to crowd control him. Uh, let's see. No, uh, uh, yes. The de the uh, All of the debuffs go away, and decay specifically goes away when you go down. So the decay is also gone. Uh, it, takes right. a, it takes a heal to get you back up. Okay, well, I should uh, probably go next. Right, but I'm not done with bad guys yet. Oh. Uh, this guy here uh, advances on the gate, looking all menacing, right. waving his sword. I want to try stopping him as he advances with crowd control. Uh, roll a hit. Uh, I did. I got a five. Uh, he ignores you. Okay, well, very rude. Uh, this guy all the way back here. Wow, you guys are barely in range. Uh, Rahul, you are closer, so this guy here... Uh, is going to go ahead and attack you with a shuriken. Okay. Eh! He whips. Can I do it? Sure, he can. Yeah, sure, he can. Sure, he can. Um, all right. That is the uh, end of uh, bad guys.
Uh, none of us have any dots. So, all right. Once again, a uh, a heal can get somebody back up. It doesn't actually restore any of their stuff. It just gets them back up. So, well, um, then, uh, I assume is, I have to scramble up to get a uh, line of sight to him. You do. So go ahead and get line of sight. So go ahead and scramble. That's nothing. Well, let me see um, if I have any a paper use. I don't one. even have any athletic sight, so I wouldn't. I'm going to yep. do it again. All right, try again. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Sure you can. That is the last shuriken pun we'll be making. You say that now. That's what you think. Hit the keys harder. Hit them harder. Does does it work with macros if you press up arrow? I'll just redo the last macro. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah, it does the same text. Wow. Welcome to virtual reality where you're just stumbling around. Uh, you have a third action. And the waste of them all. Katsu is frozen with fear. Uh, oh my god, everyone's dying and it's all my fault. I don't know what to do. Untangle the cords from around your legs already. Okay, uh, Rahul and Ohira. Hey, Rahul, you want to get nice and close to that guy first? Uh, sure. I don't think... Okay, let's do it like us. Uh, you can move in and still hack the sword. The mere act of being next to them is flanking. Okay, so I move in. Okay. So your character makes menacing gestures, but I believe you want to invoke cheating power because you're a cheating bastard. Yes, please. Okay, cheating is a role of your mind, deceit, and cheating power die. And my cheating power goes down uh, one size. Okay. Uh, all right. So out of the three options to pick, uh, there's change cosmetic, give another character focus, take control of a level one monster. We're all level five. Um, but notice that one of the options on the menu is if your very next action is to use cheating power again, you can roll a bonus 3d6. Would you like to choose that and try again next round with a bonus 3d6? Definitely. All right, also, so... if I were to pick some favorite use, uh, I could, otherwise, uh, what uh, skill would I have to have to use a, a favorite use on cheating? Deceit. Yes, it's deceit. Which I believe you have because oh. you're a criminal, right? Oh, there, I forgot. I, yes, I missed that one. Okay. It's actually a favorite use as cheating for deceit. Yep. Uh, do you mind if I roll it, uh, uh, if I add it to this roll? Yeah, go ahead. That's a, if you missed a die, go ahead and roll it and throw it in there. That's why we do that. Uh, now, if you do declare a favorite use uh, of, um, uh, if you, it, power dice uh, are dwindle dice. When they roll ones, they shrink in size. If you re-roll them, they're re-rolled at the shrunken size, and if on the reroll they roll another one, they go down again. That is specifically mentioned in the book. So be careful about re using favorite use on um, power dice. Yes, I am aware. Okay, but I think that's only two successes. That's still not enough to unlock the uh, um, uh, lock. I think you need three successes for that. So, uh, in fact, is it even on the list? Well, it's a three. It'll, it'll be three successes to go ahead and do that. So I assume you're going to pick if your very next action is to use cheating power again. Roll a bonus three d six, right? Yes, please. Okay. Uh, and and for those of you playing along at home, that's in the book because instead of making something take more time, like telling people to just take more time, we put in this rule I have to call the ladder rule, which is you keep getting bonuses to your roll until you either hit it or until you burn through all your cheating dice. So yeah. So you open the window and you're you know hitting a bunch of commands. And, oh, no, they must have updated the server. Damn it. Uh, and you're trying a bunch of tricks that you think will fool the database. Uh, and to answer a question in the text chat, I believe that is noted in, in the rules. Uh, it's an easy one for people to miss. Uh, I, may, I may flag it later. Okay, so you're cheating like a mofo. 
uh, O'Hira, the just because uh, Rahul is cheating in real life doesn't mean he's not flanking in the VR. This is well, very true. Hey, thanks for being really distracting. As he's about to try to kill you, I'm going to try to kill him. Uh, that is an eight and also four Hit. successes. Hit and dead. All right. Goodbye. And I'm loaded, which is also nice. I'm going to move yeah. in uh, 10 meters. All right. Funk, funk. And then you'll move in. Oop. You're aggressive, so you can keep moving in. Okay, and Katsu is fumbling around, and uh, Susano is like, look, your screen is turned all black and white and blurry. I'm just a body on the ground. I haven't uh, walked how... out yet. Uh, for some reason, what's that song? How could this happen to me? Oh, I thought you were going to go, so mistakes. you had a bad day. <laughs> Take a look around. No, it has to be a yeah, worse these song. are two different songs. But I know, I know, I just that's one I would go to. Okay. Um... End of our heroes. Uh, who has a decay? Uh, that's me. Everybody. I got two. Everybody. All right. Uh, your decay hits you. You may soak it. I have heard Gothic, which gives I you have one success no matter what. Yep. Yeah. I mean, until we get to decay three yeah, I... or four, it doesn't really matter. Right. Okay. Uh, all right. So, Katsu, you have a two. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. It becomes four. It doubles every round. Ooh, Ooh. scary. Uh, so those of you who had twos, it becomes four. Those of you who had one, it becomes two. So yeah, it starts off pretty tiny, but that will stack up. Plus also, it does stack with the vulnerabilities. So speaking of vulnerabilities... Um... Rise of bad guys. The boss, uh, all the way up there in fog in the tower. All of you have a decay effect, so they do not. Uh, her cackling does nothing. Uh, the three generals here. Ohira, you are in the front. You now have vulnerability three. Oh boy. Uh, also, a ninja throws a shuriken at your face. Uh, will you dodge or shoot? I'm going to try counterattacking. All right, bring it. I have six. I also have a six. Simultaneous hit. I hit you for three points, and you're vulnerable three, so that becomes six points of damage. And I return with four damage. I am so, killed. So you said six. So let's go ahead and start with the soak and see what I get. All right. Uh, that's going to be two successes total for just soaking three, so now I'm down to three. Yep. Uh, I'll go ahead and take that as three uh, HP. Okay. The second guy is going to attack. Uh, how will you defend yourself? Did you reload? Uh, no, I did not get enough successes to reload, so now I'm only dodging. All right, I've rolled a four. I got a three. You're hit for three plus three, six points of damage. You guys are rolling terrible. When we get in All this right. room, we are rolling terrible. Yeah, you guys were doing awesome before. All right, so this time uh, I get to one, two, three. I get to soak seven and get an additional point of vulnerable. Yep, as armor chips off of you. Sweet. Okay. Uh, this last guy throws a shuriken at you. He's rolled a five. Ah! <laughs> you're hit again for three plus three plus another one because you're more. You're hit for seven points of damage. Oh my god. I could have technically soaked all of it, but I only soaked three of that. So now I'm down to four, which uh, if we've done the increase, or have we not? Or uh, uh, panic soak. It, it, it was three, and then you're vulnerable four, so that's seven points of damage. Right, right. Well, I'm subtracting like the three soaks, so I have to soak four more. Yep. Uh, I'm just trying to find where my panic soak is on my sheet. The panic I'll soak's two. It. The panic no, there also... it is. It's just right underneath the number. So it's I two. could uh, panic... And lose all my HP and live. You're still alive. All right. Uh, this last ninja uh, is going to attack Rahul. Rahul, uh, the ninja throws a shuriken at you. Uh, are you going to counter or, well, I guess dodge. That works. Okay, I miss. Okay, that's the exciting villains because they mostly tag with debuffs and then shuriken and they're in a defensive posture. Uh, um, and anybody and anybody who doesn't have a decay gets a decay, except for downed people. Okay, um, 
Rise of Good Guys. Katsu, you can show us a good roll this turn, can't you? I hope so. Let's see. All right, come on. You just need one success. You're rolling two Here dice. You can totally do this. Totally. You can move 20 meters. Wow. Don't go past the front line. Yeah. Go in there. Don't enter the All room. Right. The room is what kills you. And I believe as one of your actions, you want to use cleric power to make Susano rise from the grave. Yes. And All right. my next move is going to be cheating power just so I can maximize some dice, I hope. But wait, that has to be one of my menu choices. So here we go. Uh, what do you mean by maximize your dice? I'm not, I'm not sure what you're Maximize the amount of dice I can roll, if possible. But, was that an, um, was that an option on the chat? All right. Um, all right um, I, I hear what you're saying, but I'm looking at the cheating menu, and I don't remember that being an option. Is that something we said was an option? It's under cleric power. Oh, under cleric power. Okay. Yes. Sorry. I kept saying and cheating let me power. See what my reason. favorite use is for. Uh... Oh, my die dwindled. Shit. Okay. So, will tactics and cleric power. Uh, and, and also it may have changed since the macro, so, because I updated Oh man, it dwindled from a D4 as well, which is what, nothing now? Yeah. Yeah, it went down to nothing. Well, you still have one success. Yes. Uh, okay. Uh, a heal requires at least two. What's your motto? Well, you can, my motto is doing it their way isn't as much fun. You can invoke your personality uh, yes. and roll again. Well, there's no personality anymore. Well, it's called Force of Personality is the name of the gift. Oh, yeah, so okay. Invoke your Sorry. Motto. And go ahead and roll again. Uh, the die doesn't count on the re-roll because it dwindled, so it's not yes. there anymore. Doesn't matter, so, roll the one again anyway. All right. Well, you, man, you... Uh, okay. I said this, I know. I know, it's like... You have two total now. (laughs) But that's two successes, so you are healed, Susano. You may rise again. I could have also had used cheating power on my next action to get 3d6. Uh, That's a one-star result. Oh! um, Yeah, uh, that's a typo. Okay. (laughs) Uh, um, it's meant to be specifically for laddering up cheating more. Uh, no, that's supposed to be cleric power. If your next roll is a cleric power roll. Oh, okay. That is uh-huh. a that is a typo. So the good news is, if you scored one success, you could roll again next round and get a bonus three d six. But we have a problem. Your cleric power die has dwindled from a d four to Nothing. Nothing, yes. Now that it has dwindled, you may no longer use cleric power because you requires a power die and you no longer have that power die. You may no longer use clerical powers. Your monobar is drained to zero. Yep. Now, there is a gift in the game called Cleric Soak that if you tap it, would recharge the die. But yes. I don't think you have I that. need that kind of thing. Okay. So, you know, the good news is you could pick the, uh, the build, but uh, the bad news is... Um, it's tapped out. So uh, you will raise Susano, and this rec- and this uses up all your mana points. I like to think this uses that thing from Sweet Home where you have a, a, a progress bar in front of you, a meter bar, and you, you tap a button to choose how much magic points this costs, and you just tap max, and it costs everything. Damn it. Yeah. Well, I have uh, one more action. You I'm have one more try- action. You could rally the hell out of Susano, who has zero hit points. Yes. Let's do that. But the uh, cleric. I don't know why this is taking so long. Uh, oh my god! <laughs> what is, is your, I think your favorite use is rally other, isn't it? That's for the weapon. Oh, okay. So it's for the weapon. Yeah. Um, uh, Arclight, do, the- do not play the lottery tonight. Yes, I don't think I would do that well. I mean, at the very least, though, if I hit somebody, I can at least maybe get back my frenzy. <laughs> well, okay, uh, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm going to spend a uh, 
XP to change my favorite use from uh, Virginia Caduceus to Rally Other. Uh, you know, I'm going to go ahead and allow that. So go ahead and spend one XP to do that. Uh, and now go ahead and re-roll that one. Uh, I'm a very much of a fan of the epiphany moment where the, something happens in the story rather than outside of it. So, uh, yep, spend the one XP, re-roll that, will die. I can't help but look at how bad O'Hira's position is, even in comparison to mine. Yeah, and this would be kind of the anime moment. Oh my god! Um, Shit. Uh, we need some sort of epic fight music to show how slowly we're dying. Like this is the episode that all the the people complain about on the boards, which is like, oh man, they just like made Katsu so terrible and incompetent. I hate him so much. Why yeah, but it's so probably in an awesome scene where you know you do the slow motion, cutting back and forth to everybody doing their final death, you know, attacks. What? Why can't I help? Everyone's dying. Yeah, and this is how we pad the episode out to 22 minutes. Everyone's dying, and I can't save them. Oh, my God. It's all on top of me. Oh, why Why did I ever do this back in high school? Flashback to, like, 15 minutes in high school. Meanwhile, the, like, MMO is still going on. You're going, Katsu, or, hello, hey, hey. Demony's flashing back, and in the middle of a fight. Yeah, in any <laughs> moment of self-doubt, he's going to be remembering this moment when he watched somebody charge to their death. Okay, um, well, that was a staggering display of terrible luck. Uh, who would like to go next? Uh, Ohira? Uh, I'd like to go ahead and rally my friend over here who has some uh, decay that's going to get even worse. You know, Katsu uh, has four on him, right? All right, so that's an Let's action. go for Katsu. Thank you. I couldn't tell where his arrow was going, that's why I said it. Okay, you may remove the decay, and you could remove vulnerable or recharge a hit point. And then I have to run behind this wall. Goodbye, everyone. Okay. Um. Yeah, I think that a tactical retreat is what we should do right now. Okay, that removes the the panic, but doesn't, uh, recharge. doesn't recharge the soak. I need to get rallied for that. Yeah. So, um, either self rally or, or, um, actually in the, in the new rules that doesn't actually remove the panic, you actually have to retreat and you didn't retreat. You defensively moved because you took an action to rally a friend. So, right. Okay. So I'm still uh panicked right now. Yeah, so you're still... In fact, uh, we're going to have to roll this back a little bit because uh, I forgot you were panicked. When you're panicked, you're not allowed to rally other people either. Oh, okay. So you're going to run away and rally yourself, which is the same role. Okay. So, so, so you go ahead and recharge Panic Soak and remove Panic. That's one rally. And you could recharge some hit points or remove a decay or something like that on yourself. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of all that vulnerable because that makes the decay even worse too. Right. Okay. So, um, right. So, in other words, rallying yourself is no longer automatic in these rules. You have to make a roll to do it. So, Katsu oh. still has a decay. So, Rahul okay. and Suzano, you are the next two people who can take actions. Uh, Rahul, I think you want to move defensively back and keep cheating. Uh, yes, please. I am very bad at uh, rallying anybody, so I really don't want to. Go ahead and make your cheating roll, and you get a bonus 3d6, because that's what you picked last time. Uh, while we're waiting for that, well, I guess I'm not sure if Susano knows what they want to do or they want to wait. Of course, I always know what I want to do. What do you want to do? I want to Hector Charge. My best chance at survival is refreshing my frenzy, <laughs> so I've got to try to attack. Okay. I don't think you entered the right thing in there, Avery. Yeah, yeah I see it. But right. Let me try crawling it manually. Okay, so Susano, who are your targets? I guess I'm going to go this way. It's the best number I can pull. Just getting the one in front of me and then the big guy behind him. Okay, roll to hit the ninja in front of him. He dodges because he can't counterattack. These dice, man. I am going to use my motto. All right. Oh, what a hero you have found in me. 
re-roll and add the second roll to the first and use the highest die as your target. Okay, so you have one, two, three, uh, and if you're proficient with this, four successes. So that is going to kill the first guy. The second guy could actually dodge, but does not. So you're going to hit him for seven points. Uh, yeah. That's actually going to kill me. And it refreshes my Frenzy Soak, which gives me some soak. And that does recharge Frenzy Soak. Okay, and then you'll move to where he was, and if you've got more movement, you can keep moving. Well, that was like 5.7, so I've got, what, 4.3 left? Yep. You know what, I'm just going to stop okay. here, because I, I think that gives me within, uh, no, it doesn't. Never mind. I just keep going. <laughs> there you go. All right, because if you want to be in counter range, you, yeah. Well, yeah, it was in counter range. I was thinking of crowd control range, but I won't, none of my moves will put me in range of this guy, so he's just going to be All out right. there. So yes, ah, killing makes me feel alive. Killing like. makes me feel good. All right. Oh, that so, should have been my motto. Okay, so, um, all right, end of heroes. Decay hits you. The decay is whatever the number is plus any vulns that you have on you. I'm still pretty good. Though I think I gain a vulnerability because I just managed to soak very well. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, did you actually roll well enough to... Uh, yeah, yeah, I think... Uh, yeah, you soak five and you can rally a friend. Yeah, so I'm going to rally uh, a hero here. Okay. Uh, you got to remove his vulnerability? Yes. All right, boom, it's gone. Cool. Okay. Uh, now that you've survived the decay, uh, go ahead and double it. So if it's one, it's now two. If it was two, it's now four. Did anyone have a four? Yes. It's no. eight! <laughs> Someone better rally you or it's going to hurt. Um. Okay. Rise of bad guys. Katsu, you're standing out there in the open. <laughs> Just uh, uh, going to throw a shuriken at your face. No. Okay. I got to uh, dodge. I think yep. I can't. Uh, no, in the new, well, you're not you're not aggressive, so no, right. you have to dodge. Uh, he hits you for three points of damage. Do you have any vulnerabilities? No. Ah, uh, three points of damage. Soak it. How much hit points do you have left? How many hit points? Yeah, I'm just wondering. I think I should have all of them. Yeah. Really? Okay. So you scored uh, uh, a whopping one success. Well, uh, technically two with the missiles, but, but, I, but that doesn't give me any extra penny. Doesn't matter. You'll soak three points, so you're fine. Yeah. Okay. I mean, you're rolling like ass, but you're still fine. Okay. That's the only bad guy that's on you. Susano, the two surviving generals wave their hands. You have vulnerability too. Awesome. Um, this, uh, this sword guy here is going to go ahead and attack you. Which one? Uh, sorry, I keep forgetting it doesn't highlight this guy. Oh, that's a sword guy? I thought that was the drum guy that did the uh, passive AoE things. Oh! I zoom in. Yeah, because there are four drum guys on the field and we've been getting ah! four vulnerabilities. Sorry, I, uh, I did that thing where I zoomed in too fast and it dropped me out. Oops. Okay. No, we're not even supposed to be here. We were off today. Yeah, we were off today. All right. Well, I'll make this easier because that's the wrong guy. That's the wrong figure. Sorry, I was zoomed out too far. Uh, and I am an old man. Hold on, I gotta zoom very slowly or I'll accidentally leave the map. What browser are you using? Firefox. I mean, I use Firefox. It doesn't do that to me. Neither it does uh, not to me. 
Uh, you guys are not doing the same thing. I'm. If you hold on the Alt key and uh, use the wheel, it zooms in and out. Yeah, but it's never kicked me out of a page before. Uh, it might just be something. Alt used to be my push to top button. That's why I'm saying that. Because yeah, I used to so do if, that all if, the time. If I hold it. If I don't hold down Alt and zoom too quickly, it will drop me out. Okay. Yeah, those aren't supposed to be drum guys. I'll just delete them. That makes that easier. Oh, I thought you were going to change them into sword guys. No. Uh, that wouldn't be fair to you. Uh, however, the, this boss guy is going to come by and teach you the error of your... Uh... Okay, first, this ninja guy is going to move up to you so he flanks you. Uh, and then stops. He doesn't actually attack you. Because the boss is going to move up and destroy your face. Oh, I want a tactics bonus. Uh, yes. I'll counter. All right. Whoosh! He swings that giant sword in the horse cutter maneuver. Is this your favorite weapon? Nope. <laughs> can I spend an XP? You can spend XP and make it your favorite weapon. Yeah. I go from you 4 XP to 3 XP, and I'll change my favorite weapon from the Wakazashi to... What is this? Uh, Rutinsu. This isn't the Wakazashi? Oh, okay. No, this is the Rutinsu. No, the Wakazashi was like the level 3. This is the level 5. Right. Go ahead and reroll 1 1. I assume you're going to pick the D12. Come on, you got 50 50. Uh, no, I can't use the D12 because this is, that would be for aggro. This is a counter. Oh, okay. That's okay. Well, reroll that body and try not to suck. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Well, uh, that's a hit for 4. How many vulnerabilities do you have on you? 2? Uh, yeah. That's it for six. In the real world, I'm just looking at the ground. Uh, let's see here. I'm looking at a one. Uh, yeah. This isn't my favorite outfit either, because I'm still listed as having the favorite outfit for the last level. You want to spend XP, but yeah. I think it's going to save you. I'll use an XP again. All right, we roll one one. Uh, I like things that make people you, you do things in the heat of the moment. That's how I like to do it. All right. Yes. So two. That didn't change anything at all. I don't know why I did that. But anyway, <laughs> I don't know why you did that either. I mean, it's good to update. Uh, so let's see. How much damage did you say it was? Uh, four plus two. It's six because you have a vulnerability. I'm two. down again. Yeah, you're down again. Wait, 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 wait. Uh. So three minus my frenzy soak, which is five. Uh, I tap uh, automat arms. I break my That's... arms. You're still up. And then I pull out my wakizashi. No. <laughs> All right, I've tapped everything. I'm still up. Okay. Um. <laughs> you totally are. Uh, this ninja's going to move over here and throw a shirk in your face. He's going to roll a four. All right. Um, the consideration I have to make is, did I break the arm holding the shield, or did I break the arm holding the sword? You broke the arm holding the sword. Uh, but you but that's extra arms. That's four arms. You can have a sword and shield your two main arms. Oh, that is right. That 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 you got me. That's right. Cuz one is a two-handed sword and one's a one-handed shield, so I still have a thir fourth arm. No, yeah. no, no. It's the No, because automatic arms gives me four arms. So that means I have two she uh two extra arms that just break off, which yeah. means the two-handed sword I have to pick from the two-handed sword or the one-handed shield. Yeah, you would probably, since you're vulnerable, you would probably break the sword and keep the the one the right. Wakasashi so shield defense. Yeah. Well, no, no. no cause the uh, I was using the Rutinsu is what I'm saying. The Rutinsu is a two-handed sword. Right. You have four arms. You can use a two-handed sword, I, a one-handed sword, and a shield. I don't though because I just broke uh, automatic arms to get the extra defense, uh, extra soak. Right. So the two-handed sword is gone, and you're keeping the the one-handed sword and the shield. Well, I don't. I'd have to equip the one-handed sword. I, I wasn't carrying an extra sword on my hand. I was. That was a joke. I was making a joke then. Okay. Well, then you probably just have the shield because you probably don't want right, to die. Right. I have to pull out the Wakasashi later. All right. Well, I just threw a shirk in it. Yeah, yeah and I soaked. I mean, I All soaked. Right. I tied you with a shield. Okay. Hey guys, I could easily use some help out here. Okay, um, all right, and uh, everyone who doesn't have a decay gains a decay, so congratulations, Sano, you have decay one! 
Uh, I actually got that last time, so now I'm at decay two. Oh, oh no! Well, it uh, at the end. Sorry, don't raise it to two just yet. End of good guy's turn, which means damage over times. Decays hit you, so that's one plus another two because you're vulnerable. I soak it. All right. Didn't we roll this already, like ten minutes ago? Yeah, the rounds are only taking ten minutes. This game is pretty fast. But then I haven't done anything yet. No, you did your cheat roll. Remember? I did not anything. Oh, since sorry, I rolled. We missed a lot of our turns over here. Sorry, sorry. I, 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 uh, I. Mine's been pretty long. That's why I just did mine already. So when it comes back around to me, I won't have to do it again. <laughs> Okay, sorry. Uh, I, I, I thought I thought this was the same round as Ohira was retreating and Rahul was retreating and uh, Katsu was failing a bunch of rolls. I thought it was, but... I haven't run yet. Uh, would okay, you... I apologize. Uh, who wants to go next? Uh, I could stand here and rally everyone's debuffs and then Katsu can focus on the better heals that he has to bring up Suzano and actually... Uh, use... Okay, so Hero wants to start. You take an extreme stance that gives you two actions. Oh, okay. So uh, I'm going to start with rallying. I'm going to go ahead and rally Katsu first. All right, go ahead and roll with your will and tactics. I can't see what's happening out there. I assume you're doing great, Katsu. Okay, that is one success. So you may remove one debuff or heal a hit point. I want to get rid of that, of like, 8 long. to 16 decay. <laughs> yeah, get rid of decay. And Rahul, uh, I know exactly what you're doing and how hard it is, but I'm pretty sure you can handle it. Yeah, we've never given anything before. The power of friendship! And I believe that's one success for Rahul. The power of professional relationships. Okay, so I believe Rahul is still cheating. I already rolled a three successes last turn. Okay, my bad. So, because I remember you were having trouble with that. Okay, you have removed the level lock from this level 99 sword. All right. I believe I should move up and start killing things. Okay. Remember that if you glitch while using the sword, the level lock will return. Uh, real quick. Can you take a step back one moment? I wouldn't have had to have broken my uh, my arms because I got frenzy soaked back from attacking those guys last. Okay, Susano, everybody gets one, so go ahead and do it. Right. Okay, uh, Rahul, uh, you may move up to ten meters. Uh, Katsu, um, what do you want to do? Well, it looks like Rahul still has the uh, decay debuff, so let's rally that off. Him. No, 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 I don't. Okay, then. Uh, you mean no hero? Yeah. No hero, yeah. yeah. And I also, and, but Suzano is also in a world of hurt. Yeah, so, yeah let's yes. go for him first in case I need to do it more than once. I mean, effectively, my vulnerability and uh, decay yeah. are the same as his for decay. Okay, you get. I'll give you another one. Damn it! What what the hell, man? How, oh about, my how about you give me one at all, oh, man? God. Wait, wait, wait! You Didn't you? Yeah, I would say you so just spent go. an XP. Maybe I need to be yeah, the cleric. What is with your? If we go through the like the the timeline of this. It's like this is some terrible rolling. Oh uh, my guys, god! Guys, maybe try rolling it manually and not with the script. No, he's just using the uh, parentheses. That's still... He's rolling it normal. Yeah, um... Well, uh, awesome. Yeah, the... The uh, the macro says you're rolling 1d6. You're just rolling like... Ah! Guys, I'm doing the best I can out here, but I could really use some heals. Oh my god, that is like... Wow. Oh, that is just terrible, man. That That is like... Man. I'm trying, guys. Uh, and you've already tapped all your get reroll stuff too. All right, Katsu yeah. is just like sucking, dropping frames and dropping packets. Uh, it is just terrible. Oh my god. Um, was that were you the last guy? 
I think you were the last guy. I believe so. <laughs> Healing the NPCs. All right. Well, uh, now it's the end of the round. Now the decays kick in. So the decay does the whatever number it is plus the vulns you've got. So I take uh, one damage, but I have no further means to soak anything. So I am actually down. Oh my god! I gave my life to try to help everyone else. Okay, a hero actually goes down. Alright! And Katsu, out of cleric dice. Uh, so, uh, everybody else soak? Include, uh, how did everybody else do? I did my soak before when we thought the round was over the first time. <laughs> Okay, so you're, I guess you're fine? Yeah, I was fine. All right. Uh, so, um, and if you guys don't have any vulnerabilities, you don't have to roll. Does anybody have to, who else has to roll? Are we I done? don't think I, I got rid of my uh, okay. debuff. Uh, all right, well, if that is the end of the, the good guys and all the damage over time, uh, it is now Rise of Villains. So, um, well, uh, Rahul, you are closer because you're aggressive. So this ninja here is going to throw a shuriken at your face. How will you defend yourself? I will don't. All right. Wow, I rolled a six. I have an eight. You're missed. Okay, this ninja that's back here will do the same thing. And throw a shuriken and at your face. Yes, the same thing. Uh, roll to six. No, you're hit for three points of damage. Which I can actually soak without any dice. Okay, so you're fine. Uh, it's it's the debuffs that make this way more dangerous. Is this the game that yep. has the three fours in a row is bad news? Yeah. Uh, okay, uh, yeah, it's, it's, uh, if you roll three fours, that's a glitch. Glitch, glitching is fours. Right, I just don't remember it, so I was trying to think if that was this yeah. game. Four, four is an unlucky number, so if you roll three fours, that's a glitch. Okay, this, uh, ninja moves up and attacks you, Susano! I'm going to counter. I feel like this is the moment where I'm like, hey, you guys want to get some food after this or something? <laughs> I'm really hungry right now, and I don't think we're going to have to wait much longer. Favorite sword. All right. I mean, I'm feeling like right about now-ish. Hunger. All right. So I rolled... Wow, I'm rolling... And I'm rolling great. So I believe I hit you for three plus your vulnerability of two. That's five points. Uh, I soak five. And I can move, right. but I'm not going <laughs> to. All right. Okay, uh, this guy here, uh, Rahul, you will be tagged with one point of vulnerability, and this guy will tag Katsu for one point of vulnerability. And then the boss is going to go ahead and murder Susano as, uh, you know, he makes a slick move, backs up, bounces on his back foot, and then stabs at you. Down which right makes again. no sense because it's a ninja toe and doesn't actually have a stabbing point. Wow, I rolled per not very good, but you managed to roll even worse. This room is cursed. Okay, that's uh, four points plus what's your vulnerability, Two. too? That's a six-point hit. Uh, it's three minus five, and I've still got the automat arms, which I no <laughs> longer have. All right. So I'm still up. All right. Um, I just downed him a shield arm. Well, I've got another ninja here, so he's going to run up and attack you. Count of the shield. I, I, I'm just walling today. All right. Uh, wow, you guys actually lived. Uh, if uh, anyone doesn't have a DK... Uh, all right, so... Uh, and anyone who doesn't have a DK gets DK1. So if you don't have a decay, add decay one. So I think I'm at uh, decay four now. 
that is the uh it doesn't double it's just go ahead the villain adds it at the end of their round and then on your round if you like have to live through it no so i thought you... yeah i thought you said it doubled every time so i'll go from one to two oh. now i'm at two so i go to four right okay so rise of good guys all right ohira is down your cleric is out of um uh oh man it does yeah is out of those so um susano is hurting yeah let's um, try to rally his ass all right get up man we're gonna die i just said that that's why i asked you if you want to get something to eat later <laughs> that is one success uh right, are you gonna you remove... like so i assume you're gonna remove the decay since that's a four point hit yeah and right. uh let's try again to see if we can't also remove the vulnerable because that's yeah. sucking for me. you're sitting here clicking through all your menus gotta do the q and the w ah oh, the r didn't recharge damn it there we go all right so you can remove the vulnerable um i mean yeah. oh no, no no you can't get rid of the other thing that's that's a cleric thing never mind actually yeah don't go ahead never mind okay we need to yeah i'm gonna look at your care we need to get you more dice you do not have enough dice well, I have yet to actually put marks into tactics. Yeah. So there is that. Well, I'm also I'm a little, yeah I'm also a little concerned about the build, so I'm going to review some of these things here. Like, play build, picking a character should naturally give you more dice than what you need. So, what is your build again, Katsu? I, I forgot. Your what, what's your player and avatar? User hacker player opportunist avatar influence. You're an opportunist, okay, which I think is not a team player character. Okay, but that's a valid build. All right, um, something to think about. Okay, Susano, did you want to act or did you want to wait? Uh, sure, I'll act. All right. Uh, I'm going to attack one of these weaker. I'll attack the guy behind me. Okay, the guy behind you will dodge. Wakazashi, which I have to type out because I don't have it. I am rolling excellently today. One sec. I've got uh, D6 fighting, okay. It's D8 he's harder! Speed, D12 for yep. aggressive. Yep. Yep. Alright. Uh, he's dead. Recharge your frenzy soap. Finally. The only healing I can get is my own. Uh, okay, Ohira is still dead. So, uh, Rahul. Well, I think it's time for me to move in. Remember, you only get one hit with that cheat sword. Well, no, it's if it glitches, so... Oh, no, the last... Well, the, the only time I used it, you said it died immediately, because the game Because you glitched it. on the very first roll. Did I? Okay. Yeah, you glitched on the very first roll. I don't remember. Well, remember, it lets yeah. you roll body, speed, mind, will, aggressive. I mean, you rolled like nine dice with it, but it just glitched. Okay. I thought it was just the game detected me the moment I used it. No, it was a, you glitched on the first roll. The more dice you roll, the more likely you are to glitch. Well, go to town then. <laughs> well, you can't reach them from here with the Sword of Truth, so... Is that what, this, is that what the name yeah. means? Uh, it's the Sword of Truth. Moving forward still, yeah. Okay, so and all right, you can move another ten meters. Hello. All right. Oh, uh, you guys are still alive. Okay, uh, and I think Rahul was the last one. All right. Um, end of round. Decay activates. Whatever your decay number is, you must soak that amount of damage. Uh, Ohira, your decay went away when you went down. Yep. Yep. Okay, so I, I think, uh, yeah, I think you guys soaked it just fine. And going to rally uh, Rahul. Oh, yeah, because you could soak for free with armor. Rahul, uh, you have a rally, so you can remove the decay or uh, recharge uh, a hit point. I would prefer to remove vulnerability at this point. Okay. Go right ahead. Uh, all right. That is the end of Heroes Rise of Villains.
Uh, Susano, you are made vulnerable for one point. Rahul, you are made vulnerable for one point as these guys wave their fans at you. Uh, Katsu, this yes. ninja runs up to you and throws a shuriken at your face. Oh, no. Dodge. 